How's it going, you guys? My name is Danielle Gianda. Uh, I am a pop and R&B singer. I've been performing, competing, writing, and recording songs for the past 14 years. And music is my passion, so I just want to let the world know very, what I got. She's a very, very talented, multi-talented artist. She writes songs, and uh, she has a wonderful voice. We got a couple of tracks we're going to... Um, Try to get going just so uh, you all could get a taste of if what she have, has. If you have a moment, MP3 Spawn can. Uh... Oh, that's already in the process, sir. <laughs> oh, yeah. You already know how I do. I'm about my business. You already know. He beat you to the yeah. punch. Spawn? <laughs> you, are, you better bet it. So, this is Danielle Deanda, and we will be giving you some from her shortly. So, uh, and, then we, and then sitting next to her is Kelsey. Who is fantastic, by the way. She Kelsey is. King. Make sure we say that last Kelsey name. King. As in King of the Perv oh. Magnets. Oh. No. <laughs> it's probably true. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, of course, they're yeah, both, I mean, Derek Scave and Blade can back me up on this. They are both white women, so he, oh, okay. they're off limits to him. Oh, correct? you are <laughs> off limits. <laughs> What are you, huh? What are you, huh? Good luck. Kelsey, Jiggy was wanting to know if he could get that like laminated that picture of you. So when he's in the shower, I mean, sorry, never mind. That's right. That's why I brought that picture for you. I was looking at. But Miss Kelsey and can you make pictures? Can you make copies of that? Are you surprised that I'm black? Because they keep making this joke like I do have a scanner, scanner printer in the back. Hell yeah. I look black. What are you trying to call me, Oreo? Goddamn it! No, you can't because it doesn't surprise me. You look at it. Oh wow! I, I look black. Believing. You look. <laughs> look. <laughs> it must be the nose. I'm gonna look. Got it. No, you good? Well, you good? Thank you. Thank you. You're looking awfully dapper. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Does Georgia get upset? <laughs> Hey, man, hey, 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 they over there, and, 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 and okay, Kuna... Well, what Kuna, hey, Kuna was saying was that nobody knows he's an Orthodox Jew. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, no, he looking damn. at you like, what the hell is that? Well, he said George was anti-Semitic, so he didn't want to, you know. Oh, my gosh. Hey, we need a new translator. Because you made <laughs> we need a new translator. <laughs> you made his dick go soft with that one, because he didn't understand. Well, I'm not exactly trying to excite him, you know what I mean? <laughs> Don't hey, wanna... you that that hey, hey man, you don't well, really want to uh, turn them on like that. You won't really so, turn, turn so, them on so I mean, DJ, he, you know who? Scary guy. Yes, sir. How, <laughs> how did you get hooked up with this artist here? So, then Danielle Deanda, we actually met on some other business. I uh, have a lot of different businesses, a lot of different things I do, but I'm going to yeah. only, only talk about what pertains to this situation. So, we meet in this other business, and... Um, as time goes on, she mentions to me that she did music, and uh, I was like, oh yeah, that's so funny, because uh, I work in the music world myself. And so um, she gave me a uh, sample of uh, her work in, in the form of a disc, and I listened to it, and I, and I, I, really, yeah. I really was impressed, thoroughly impressed with her, her talent. She's really good. So um, we spoke about working together and um, we put in some projects together we have uh, something that's untitled right now we're um, in the early game of some as far as our next project out and uh, she has a, a heavy catalog right now so um, so I'm right here to I'm here today to promote promote her and her brand and um, let you all know that we have a new project coming out soon and uh, it's going to be going down. Expect big things from Danielle Deanda. You better bet it. Mosier, you got yeah. it. Do you have anything for, uh, for our don't artist forgive here, me. Don't sir. forgive me when, when it comes to you. I won't forget you because uh, we already met and you're hella cool. You're just, so. you're just hanging out? Skate, you, 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 got, you got anything for her while, we're, while we, we're tacking with her here? Got any questions or anything? between me and her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Her last name is White, so. That's a stage. It's like that shit up on the stage. That just. Really hey, 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 they're getting a loophole in my claws, goddammit. Y'all need to cut it out. 
So, so, and and I, I, I hate to say this because I, I don't know what's going to happen here, but we always let everybody that's here interview the artists. So, Kuda, do you have anything for for our artist here? Do you have any questions for our artist? Somebody needs to interpret Kuda so she can... She, you look nice and tasty. You look very beautiful. <laughs> He said, who are some of your biggest influences and who guided you towards what you're doing? <laughs> look, 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 you just killed him every time. You just killed him. Okay, so, uh... I started singing when I was seven years old. Um, Mariah Carey and Whitney Houston. Mariah Carey's my idol. I've been singing her for the past 25 years. She, I really didn't have singing lessons. I just uh, sang her all day, every day, and that's how I got a wide range like I do. So she, she definitely inspired me. And she's the reason why I love R&B music. That's awesome. Um, I just want you have, to say, you have a follow up. No, hold up, hold up. If anybody's gonna translate Kuda, it's gonna be his manager. So let me go ahead and tell you what he actually said, and he wants to know if you taste like chicken. Oh my god. Artist oh, yeah. to artist here today on the <laughs> world famous Jiggy Jaguar oh. show. Hell yeah, it tastes like chicken with uh, <laughs> syrup on top. Oh shit! Chicken and waffles, chicken and waffles. <laughs> 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 Tell him the deal. Hey, Michael, while, while, while you're sitting over there, do you have any, you have any questions for Yeah. Her? So you said you uh, self, basically self-taught yourself. How did you go about that process? Because I know that's kind of difficult to self-teach yourself every day. Um, I just, I mean, not only did I listen to music all the time, but I watched videos and just, just, just singing all day, every day. Um, you know, practice makes perfect, so. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, I, I started singing in school and then choir, and then I did variety shows. I did, uh, like the Wichita River Festival a couple times. Um, I performed in a couple, uh, professional theater productions at the Crown of Town Theater in Wichita. What was your first show? <laughs> Jesus Christ Superstar. Hey. That's awesome. Yeah. Hey, that's cool. what it is. <laughs> For <Yeah>. sure. <laughs> no, seriously, if you, if you ever, like, watch that and listen to it, he got has some talent to be able to do that one. It's not easy. Whatsoever. You're right. And my second one was The Music Man. They were both really fun. I was in high school when I was doing that, so it was, like, four days a week for two months straight. It was fun. I love performing. I love entertaining. That's my thing. I love intriguing an audience, you know? That's awesome. Cool. I want to know what your biggest goal is. Like, are you wanting to just be at the top, going up? up? Are you wanting to be famous? Okay, so 10 years ago, I always wanted to be famous. But now that I'm older, and I have a child, and I just. I just want to be successful doing what I love to do and um, living comfortably. So, so it's so it's more about the money and being able to take care of yourself than so much as that type of shit, like the likes in your face and the fame and people all in your business, right? And your life. Because I, I feel like it's not it's not fun when you have everybody all up in your business. You know? But I'm a songwriter too, so I would love to be able to just you know sell my songs. To artists that are, you know, um, that way, you know, you can still chill and have a normal life instead of like. Always on the run, always moving. Yeah, that's a hard life. I love the piano and the violin. Those are my two favorite. <laughs> 
But I, I've never learned how to play. I, when when I you're ready, a, you let us know. And we'll just, I had a teacher that tried to uh, teach me how to play the piano, but I was like, how can you teach me how what to play at the beginning of a song that I created, you know? Okay, I, I think we may... Spawn, do you have a... Is it all ready to go? But, uh, okay, whoever, now, now. Whoever loves R&B and pop music, I just wanted to say you can check out my music at hey. ReverbNation.com slash Danielle Deanda. And right now, we have a world premiere for everyone, some Danielle Deanda popping off. We got this joint all night, and we about to give you a little snippet of what we've been working on in the studio. I said we got a major project about to drop soon. So, DJ Spawn, give it to him. Give it to him. Good, my man. Your boy, you know who checking in once again. We got Danielle Deanda on deck. She about to drop some juice right quick. World premiere. I love being sexy. I'm sorry. I just. No, I'm not wrong. Oh, that, oh, that, 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 is, that is that is not a problem here. <laughs> uh, not a problem here. See, e e even even uh, even Kuda, uh, right? <laughs> On the radio, Danielle Deanda, you better bet it. DJ Spawn live in the mix. Get it. You know who. Let's go. I know it is hard to trust people these days. It's going down. No, go to the next. Next one. Now, just to give you a little variety, we got another taste of Danielle Deander. And once again, you can catch her on Facebook. Danielle Deander. You can catch me also, DJ You Know Who, on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. You already know. Danielle Deander, world premiere. She got that flavor, she got that variety. Danielle Deander. Expect greatness coming soon. Big up to my man Jiggy Jaguar. Jiggy Jag Radio. It goes down. Let's go. Come on, come on. Spawn live in the mix. This is a DJ Spawn exclusive. You better bet it. Let's go. Listen to these lyrics right here.
coming soon, Danielle Deander. We going global. The DJ Spawn live on the ones and twos. It's going down. That was awesome. That was awesome. Good stuff. Good shit. Thank you for playing that for me and everybody else. So, so Blade, do you have any questions for uh, our artist? Uh. <laughs> oh. No. Kuda is. No, Kuda. Please was, no. grab George. Get out of control again. No. Grab George. <laughs> What is going on? Focus on George. Super one? 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 Super Cause that's what me and he wanted John, to go out. So, that's what me and John got out of it. That's, um, that's what I took from it. He wanted to go all night. I, 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 I'll say that. He, he, that's what he was saying. Look, See, that's, look, all right. Right. that's a different industry whether he's talking about. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't think he was talking about wrestling, my dear friend. No, no, he was talking about that either. <laughs> More like the <laughs> ABN <laughs> award. Yeah. yeah. Every right. time, Especially it's a niche thing. <laughs> Every time I tell people the title of my song, Go All Night, they always think it's about having sex. No, no, but, but it is not. It is not it's about arguing. I'm just saying, if you guys weren't listening. Oh, I, 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 I had a hard time listening. I was so mesmerized by your beautiful voice. Oh, guys, I got more games than all of you here. <laughs> So, um, let's do this. Where's DJ? You know who there is. Okay, my man. Everybody likes to say something badly. DJ, you know who. 